No, you're not imagining it. Your one month old is grunting and struggling to poop, especially at night, especially at night. Hi, I'm Dr. Lauren Hughes. I'm a board certified pediatrician wife and mom and owner of Bloom Pediatrics. And I'm here to tell you about your one month old. Prior to being one month old, because being born is hard and learning how to like breathe and eat and like all of this stuff, their brain has enough to do. Pooping is a reflex. So it is a reflex just the same as if I hit your knee, your leg will kick. That means every time their stomach detects food, their colon empties. That's why they poop eight bajillion times a day at the beginning. However, around one month is whenever that reflex integrates. And what do I mean by integrates? It means that your baby now has to learn how to take a dump. They also have to learn how to pass gas. That looks like grunting, straining, turning red, and not a lot of action. But you have to think of it from their perspective, which is they are contracting abdominal muscles that are really underdeveloped and relaxing a pelvic floor with an immature nervous system, having never done it before and laying on their back. It's, it's difficult. You try laying on your back to poop. What can you do about it? Well, you can do bicycle legs. You can do baby massages on your belly. You can do ankles to ears. You can put them in anatomical poop position, meaning that you sit them upright with their knees above their hips so they can have flow. And last but not least, my tried and true joke, but not joke is put them in a car seat in a white outfit and go for a ride without any backup diapers or wipes guaranteed blowout. But also know that it does end because eventually you have to learn how to poop. It's conducive with life and they will figure it out. Some kids, it takes a few days. Some kids, it takes a month. It just kind of depends.